Hello guys, today our topic is about quantum numbers. Before starting quantum numbers, we shall study some basic terms. Those are shells, subshells and orbitals. What are shells? If you consider this as a nucleus, Electrons are supposed to revolve around the nucleus in a definite circular paths. These are called as shells. These are also called as orbits. These are K, L, M, N. These are the shells. And what are subshells? Shells are further divided into subshells. Every shell consists of subshells which slightly differ in their energies. K shell consists of only one subshell that is S. L shell consists of two subshells thus are s and p m shell consists of three subshells those are s p d and f n shell consists of four subshells those are s p d f next Subshells are further divided into orbitals. When subshells undergo different subshells undergo different orientation when subjected to external magnetic field, they change their shapes. Subshells are divided into orbitals. Orbitals is defined as it is a three dimensional representation in which there is a maximum probability of finding the electron when the Schrodinger wave equation was solved for hydrogen atom the maximum probability of finding the electron is found to be spherical thus hydrogen has a spherical shape likewise S subshell has only one orbital P has three orbitals that is Px Py Pz. D has five orbitals. Those are dxy, dyz, dxz, dx square minus y square, dz square. The term S means sharp. P means principal, D means diffuse, F means fundamental. These are de derived from the spectroscopic terms. We shall study the types of quantum numbers in our next video.